Bank of America partnership with Ripple XRP. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'm going to be talking about this Ripple XRP partnership. And again, I don't like talking about rumors. So I'll be quoting the comments made on a Bank of America official website. I recommend you guys go watch the interview yourself, especially near the end of the interview where they talk about Ripple XRP. So these are not just rumors. There's lots of confirmation. You know, people at Ripple's apparently been working with Bank of America since 2016. 16 on a pilot study but these comments from key Bank of America team talking about XRP confirms the partnership so I'll talk about how it can have an impact with Ripple and XRP and what we like for XRP to come and come forward and happen and I'll, I'll, I'll talk about price as well and I've started making a lot of XRP videos again because of um, XRP bullish price action you, I hadn't been making uh, that many XRP videos and since XRP has been making those patterns that I like if you guys remember last year I was posting a lot of signals talking about buying XRP and, and we made a deep, really lot of winning trades. This was a loss because I got excited. I thought it was going to break up, break out above 30 cents and it didn't do that. It started dropping. And since then, guys, I talked about uh, XRP breaking down here uh, and uh, I was I, I made videos about selling XRP as well. Again, I'm a trader. I like to trade and make money. If you uh, follow my channel, guys, you've already seen me trading XRP, you know, uh, commenting on when I'm buying. I made this video about buying uh, XRP about three weeks ago. Again, please don't just follow me. Have a strategy. Learn why I'm doing it and try to do it yourself. And these are not after the fact. People say, oh, what's the proof? Again, I've made videos on YouTube and I provide exact signals uh, when I'm buying when I'm selling and, and sometimes people say I'm bragging when I show them exactly in the group when I'm buying when I'm selling but then if I don't show that they say oh where's the proof you're buying again there's no pleasing everyone I'll just share with you what my thoughts are and hopefully you guys can learn it from yourself if you're interested in learning more about exactly trading when I'm buying when I'm selling I'll leave the links below and talk about it at the end of the video if you're interested let me get give you the content that you're here for so um so first of all I want to say I highly recommend you go watch this and do the research yourself i'll cover what was covered in that uh, interview so blockchain shy bank of america quietly plots ripple technology so this is a very very key key news so back in 2016 we heard about this ripple spokesman's talk talked about bank of america has been part of ripple's global payment steering group since 2016 and we did a pilot with them so people got really excited back then and back then guys it was a FOMA market it was in a bull market so things were going up a lot now it's different so please don't just expect xrp to go to ten dollars five dollars overnight i'll talk about the price action that i'm uh, that i need to see and a key break of the 30 cent level before we can talk about a dollar five dollar or whatever 589 again i don't want to talk about this crazy price action i'm being conservative and i'm trading and i also share about the 20 cent level that i talked about yesterday and how i'm looking to trade it so the spokesperson would not provide further details. It was previously known that B Bank of America is a member of the steering group that advises on rules and standards of RippleNet. One more sign of Bank of America warming to the sector is job opening that bank posted earlier this month for a product manager who would lead a team for Ripple projects. So there's lots of news. Uh, Saga Shabai, uh, Ripple's head of government and regulatory affairs of Asia Pacific region made the presentation in December 2018 at a seminar conducted by IMF in Samoa on fintech and financial institution in the Pacific Island and uh, entitled a snapshot of our customers a logo of bank of america merrill lynch uh, appears at the top followed by 15 other financial institutions around the globe so you can see there's been a lot of news so what is the exact comment that bank of america made about xrp and um, i'm going to read this out to you because this is quite important so client experience that the combination of high touch and high tech is really important in a big area of focus for us so not just the capability but the actual experience and ability to get things done anytime anywhere because we are an around-the-clock society and the second goal is the ability to integrate and Derek touched on this a lot it's not about our platform our capabilities it's about you as a client and the infrastructure you have and the ability for us to integrate whether that's with platforms and capabilities that we have we built or partnerships that we have 
with the likes of Ripple and Swift. So this is the confirmation that they've built partnership with Ripple. These are fintechs that we are partnering with. And this is more important. This line is, uh, I look at it as a really positive and I always talk about concerns, uh, my concerns on XRP and and why XRP might not be as amazing investment. This is a really good comment, which is very positive for XRP because Bank of America says that they have come through all rigor of leg legal and compliance. So this is a really big comment, legal and compliance. And we are able to leverage our banking as platform to deliver that to you. So a couple of negative things that I talk about is, you know, Ripple and the compliance and whether XRP is a security. So if they've come through legal and com compliance, that is a big benefit. Another negative thing I talk about is, you know, Ripple potentially dumping XRP uh, and selling XRP that in increases the supply and that doesn't help the price of XRP. And the last one is the difference between Ripple and XRP. So if Bank of America is using Ripple but not using XRP, that's not going to be beneficial. So please don't get too excited. Again, I always seem to bring calmness and, and I seem to be talking about negatives, but just don't think, I mean, I've been making bullish videos and some of my thumbnails are, you know, for, for, or for marketing purposes purposes but the content I provide in the video is always solid I never say you know XRP is going to go to 589 or or whatever and go all in XRP I do explain when I'm buying when I'm selling with exact targets and and I like to take profit on it and look if XRP can deliver and and the partnership I hope uh, uses XRP and XRP could have world worldwide reach you know there could be worldwide adoption and that is what we want to see hopefully XRP can do that and this is a positive news so again, I want to turn it back into positives. I want to make sure I give you all the information for you to make good investment or, or trading decisions. But this is a very, very big positive. And with the price looking bullish, if we do what I said in yesterday's video, um, so one of the questions I had was, oh, Rocco, you're saying the XRP is going to have a breakout. XRP is closed above the 20 cent level that you said are you buying so i've not bought it yet what i look for is my trading strategy again please check it out you can only you can join for less than 20 pounds and see if you like it or not for this month it's still 20 pounds so check it out before um, again I, i've left it quite low because this group has just launched i mean i was charging 50 pounds previously so check it out for less than 20 pounds if you like it you can there's a trading course available as well when you join in the unit section of the group i'll show it to you so you can click the unit section and there's loads of educational stuff, strategy guides, to trading courses. So check out for a month. If you like it, great. Stay with us. I'm sure you'll like it, but it's only a small fee for now to check us out. So the trading strategy that I teach is uh, I'll let you, go, let you guys know in the group and I'll make another video if XRP does it. This is what I look for. So if we have a breakout pullback, this is what I look for. So coins like Chainlink, Bitcoin Cash, these are some signals are provided. Watch the top five videos. I'll talk about the coins I'm buying on YouTube and provide the exact entry signals in the group. And the strategy that I teach, you can do it yourself. So XTZ, you can see has done it. Link BTC. Uh, has done it so these are uh, hopefully xrp can do that as well and and i'll be very bullish on xrp so let's have a look what happens guys again i don't make crazy price predictions like uh, ten dollars five dollars and, and that's my thoughts on it but if xrp does do that guys i think xrp will be targeting the 25 cents level you know trade from uh, support and resistance that's the next resistance and before i even start talking about one dollar um, it needs to break above 30 cents and i made a long-term video on why I'm buying XRP and bull trend it needs to get above the 30 cent mark the 236 Fibonacci level before I can talk about this crazy price prediction so let's see if that if XRP does it if XRP does it I will be very bullish so thank you very much for watching this video I hope you guys enjoyed it again I tried to incorporate a news fundamental analysis to technical analysis and trading strategies uh, so hopefully you guys enjoy it so for, uh, last thing I want to say thank you very much for uh, helping me get to 8,000 subscribers guys I will be uh, doing a giveaway when we get to uh, 10k subscribers a big giveaway maybe uh, you know uh, some a uh, couple of light coins or a few hundred dollars worth of giveaway but uh, someone suggested why don't you do a monthly giveaway so maybe guys I'll be looking to do a monthly giveaway of like I don't know 100 XRP or something so if you're interested for that just comment below your XRP address a comment below your price prediction and your XRP address and then maybe every month I do 100 or something XRP 
giveaway so I'll, I'll pick I'll use a random comment so I've done these giveaways before I usually click a random comment a finder and then I do a random giveaway so make sure if you're interested subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button like the video and comment below your XRP address so thank you very much for watching this video guys uh, comment below your predictions on XRP do you think this Bank of America partnership is really good what are your thoughts on it long term and comment below your price prediction so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you guys have enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much